Leila Mukaddam, you are from the African Development Bank. Welcome to WPC TV. What are the obstacles that the ADB uh, faces? Thank you very much, first. Um, I just um, come from Egypt, four years in, in Egypt, and I think um, Egypt is, is a good example where uh, we can identify some of the obstacles that um, the African Development Bank is, is facing. And one of them is uh, to be able to leverage public money um, and mobilize private sector resources. And for that, of course, I mean, um, especially to finance infrastructure projects and, and important uh, projects, uh, including in, in uh, industrialization and also the value chain. So um, uh, the difficulty is to find the, uh, the ecosystem um, to, uh, to leverage these private sector resources. In particular, if we talk about public-private partnership, uh, what are the laws, what is the legal and regulatory framework, uh, what sorts of sectors um, do we want to target? Water, uh, not very successful, ports, airports, very successful and how to push you know, the government to take the right uh, sector policy um, decisions and, and implement them. I mean, one uh, comment that's always made, especially about the developing world, is that corruption gets in the way of the most practical and most effective solutions. I mean, that must be a problem if you're a multilateral institution, if you're the World Bank, if you're the African Development Bank, or the EIB, or whatever. Is that true? Uh, I don't think it's true because all these uh, multilateral institutions, including the African Development Bank, they have put very strict um, procedures um, and policies uh, towards um, the um, combating uh, corruption. Basically, how uh, through you know the, our procurement rules first, but also and most importantly. Uh, through the monitoring and supervision of uh, the projects we are financing, in particular um, uh, public sector projects, uh, with the government. So the government is the implementation agency, but they come back to us on each and every procurement. Of course, I mean, uh, it's light, it's not uh, cumbersome um, uh, for us to review and provide our non-objection. And um, also our presence in the field is very important towards that. First, to reach our development impact through these projects in partnership with the government. But second, to make sure that um, the, all the procurement process is done based on our own procedures and uh, it's done properly. So the monitoring very is kept strong. in place. Excellent. Thank you so much for thank coming. You. Thank you.